And so as a child of God, when life leaves us filled with despair, when there's misery all around us, yes. we have to find a promise in the word of God yes. that involves what we may be facing. We have to find out what God says about our dilemma, yes. what God says about injustice, yes. what God says about the finances that we need. We need to find out what the word says yes. about our healing and being healed and delivered from COVID-19. We need to find out what the word of God says yes. about our job and employment and, and being able to provide for our household when over the when millions and millions of people are out of work. We need to find out what the word of God says about the church and where the body of Christ is heading despite where the world is doing. Yeah. And so the Bible says that we have to have hope on what God has said. Yeah. Now, one thing I love about the promises of God is the Bible says that he's already said yes. Yeah. See, yeah. the Bible says all the promises of God to us are yes yeah. and amen. And this yeah. is major. This is critical because yeah. in the body of Christ, Christians always wonder. Now, listen, we, we know God is able. Yeah. Yeah. The question is, we don't know if he's willing. Yeah. See, but the thing about it is, when we find a promise, we no longer have to worry about whether or not God will do it. We know he's able, and we know he's going to follow through as well. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That's why, you know, sometimes I'm ministering to the sick, and then sometimes, you know, they don't understand it. You know, people have told them all kind of erroneous yeah. things in church. You know, sometimes in church, we are misinformed. And a lot of times, we have to unlearn things before you can move forward in the things of God. And I, and I never, you know, I, I let people know from the jump. Now, this, you know, healing is the will of God. Yeah. Very child of God. Healing is the children's bread. You know, if, if it's God's will for everyone to be saved, then it's God's will for everyone to be healed. And, and if it's God's will for everyone to be healed, then it's God's will for everyone to receive the Spirit. It's God's will for everyone to be provided for. And all of these things, God has given us a promise. I never have to wonder. I never have to hope and pray. I never have to doubt. I never have to disbelieve. Because God said it, I can take it to the bank. And that settles it. And so the Bible says we must hope based on the promise of God. And the Bible says all, somebody say all, all, all of the promise, not some, not half, but all of the promises of God to us are yes. And amen. He's already said yes. Amen. He's already said yes.